What's up? It's Hayden Jones from SA Boxing Talk here with your international news. Now, of course, I'm indoors today. Usually I'm giving you those nice outdoor shots. Unfortunately, it is raining, it's storming, the old man is snoring, and you're about to listen to some international boxing news right here on SA Boxing Talk. Hit that subscribe button for all the future international news, and welcome to my humble abode. Unfortunately, I have to host you here today. Well, fortunately, if you're enjoying the content. So anyway, Marcus Maidana. Let's talk Maidana. Let's talk Marcus Maidana. He's back in the, in the, in the boxing gym. He's with Alex Ariza, and he's serious about making a comeback. Like, legitimately serious about making a comeback. Now, I don't... Like, I was, I was one of those guys who was like, oh, Marcus Maidana, I shouldn't stop boxing. But, dude, it's been five years now, man. Like... I'm, I'm, I'm kind of upset that he's coming back now because I think he's going to ruin his legacy. Yeah, 35 and 5. The man retired, living a simple life. Man made a lot of money in those Mayweather fights. So I don't understand why man is coming back. Like, no. Like, no. You shouldn't, you shouldn't be coming back, man. Like, he's back. And, and the problem is he's back in the full swing of things. He didn't just come back to get in shape. Man came to come back for war, and this, is, this could be so bad. You put him against any of these current top welterweights today, everyone's like, oh, you know, bring back Maidana. He's so, you know, he's not the same Maidana that he was before. Let me, let me tell you that right now. He's not going to come back that killer Maidana that fought uh, Floyd Mayweather in the first fight. He's not going to come back with there. Alex Ariza is his trainer. Obviously, he was formerly trained by Robert Garcia. Robert Garcia is a good coach or trainer, whichever word you prefer. Robert Garcia is legit, and I think that him training with Ariza, I know Ariza is a good, uh, he, he's good with the strength and conditioning and, you know, getting guys in shape, but I don't know if this is going to be enough. I don't know, like, I'm not, I'm not happy now. I, was ha I wasn't happy when he initially retired because I thought he was, still, he was still good, but then he, like, blew up and sort of, like, became a content man like any, like any man should after their boxing career, if I'm completely honest with you. You should, you should enjoy your life, but now you're coming back, and I think, the boxing bug bit him. You know, like, boxers just cannot stay away from the sport, man. And my, my, one of my favorites of all time, not the favorite of all time, but one of my favorites of all time, Roy Jones, too. Didn't need to come back. Man in his heyday was so good. Legacy, a little bit, like, especially people from a lesser generation uh, will, th will see him in his 40s boxing bums and losing, you know. Like, that's not fun, man. That's, what, that's how they're going to remember Roy Jones. It's not how, like... We're going to remember Roy Jones, but like, I'm just saying it's bad for your image. And Maidana might just be doing the same thing. Everyone's going to be like, oh, I told you about this guy, Marcus Maidana. And, and these young kids will be coming up. Oh, yeah, that's cool, cool, cool. I'll watch some highlights. They watch the, the flames, and then they see Maidana pitching up and not doing so well. So I'm against this move, like, fully. Fully, fully, fully. And the fact is they want to fight three times this year. Three times this year. June, September, December. And they want big names. Man hasn't even fought in five years and he wants to fight three times in a year. You're not fighting four rounders. You're going to go the distance. Unless you're fighting a car guard, then, I mean, that's different. Or a bus drive. I don't know what they say overseas. In South Africa, we call them car guards. Um, but yeah, Marcus Maidana arrived at, in the gym. 218 pounds apparently they're going to bring him down to 150 and then for september and december uh, get him back in the welterweight division at 147 so yeah i'm you know my opinion obviously you guys could uh, like if you're big fans of marcus maidana you could be like you know you just want to see the guy back in the ring and whatnot <sighs> Sorry, I just, I can't. I, I, I don't want to, like, like, write your comment. Like, I, I, look, look, I, I'm willing to discuss this with anybody. I'm not, I'm not just writing it off. Like, I'm, I'm an accepting person. Like, I generally, my heart is good. Like, I, and you know, the, the funny thing is I touch my right side. My heart is good. But, you know, like, generally, like, I, 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 I'm open to discussion on things. Like, a lot of de fans have different point of views. Like, everyone's like, pro, yeah, come back. And, I, you know, I, I'm in this, I'm sitting in my chair here saying, like, I don't know if it's a good idea. But it could be a good idea. Uh, it, uh, in your mind. Let's put it that way. In your mind. I mean, the man hasn't fought since September 2014. Let's see how it goes. Let's see how it goes. Imagine he upsets the apple cart. You guys are all going to be coming back to this video and you're going to be saying, Well, this guy Hayden doesn't know what he's talking about, does he? 
But what I'm going to say is I think I'm right. So yeah. Anyway, guys, uh, thank you for listening. Uh, please weigh in with your opinion. Sorry, I just put down the coffee. Please weigh in with your opinions. Tell me if you think Marcus Maidana coming back is good or is it bad like I'm saying? Or are you indifferent? Do you care whether he's coming back or not? Do you care about his legacy? Let me know in the comments. And do not forget to hit that subscribe button. We're having discussions almost every day from now on about international boxing news. So hit that subscribe button, join the channel, join the conversations, and we shall start this little family together. Aight, thank you for listening, and I hope you're having a good day. Better than my overcast day. Aight, cheers.